Welcome back. After a long battle with work-related cancer, Rocky Hill firefighter Captain James Lemaire was laid to rest today. Fox 61's Julia LeBlanc shares the impact Jim had on his family and his family at the firehouse. A life dedicated to service. being honored by those who served alongside him. Uh, this is where Jim worked. This is Jimville right here. Captain Jim Lamar was a mechanic and a volunteer firefighter at this firehouse in Rocky Hill for 27 years. Before that, he served in the U.S. Army. His job was to take care of everything soup to nuts, apparatus, um, air packs, gear, and respond to fires. It's something Chief Michael Garrahy says Jim wanted to do up until the end. Probably uh, three weeks before Jim passed, and he's directing the repairs over the phone from his, uh, from his hospital bed. Uh, I mean, that's just the type of person he is. Something his stepchildren picked up on quickly. Fall in his footsteps. Chris Bates and his sister Kara both volunteer for the Rocky Hill Fire Department. Kara, an EMS worker, inspired by her dad's passion for service. Very, very important. Um, he loved it till the end. The person to call in a crisis, but being a dad was his first and most important role. One that you would only imagine that you would dream to have. They've all spent the last five months cherishing every moment with him. In September, Jim was diagnosed with lung cancer related to his work. But it's who he was as a person that'll stick with those he knew and didn't know forever. Jim was a very energetic, very had a very boisterous laugh, such a like, super fun guy, but also very caring. His department caring for him in the same way he always did for them. A saluted send off, all in the only way they all know how. One of my first calls in the morning, just, just a very close friend. In Rocky Hill, Julia LeBlanc, Fox 61 News.